Hey everyone, this is me, Fred. Welcome back to Jumpscape Mansion HD Renovation. Last time we got from 500 to room 600 and we encountered Specimen H. This time, we're gonna hopefully be getting to room 700. Keep that blood pop in. Home Depot pasta. Let's go. Home Depot pasta. <laughs> I'm kind of, I'm, oh my god, my voice. I'm kind of tempted to see if I can encounter specimen nine. I was expecting it, but I wasn't expecting it yet. I did. Alright, so we, we did indeed encounter specimen nine. So, yay for that. Okay. Killer, make like a tree and die. Come in this fall. <sighs> Alright. He's faster than I remember. Actually, I don't remember how fast he is, because I'd always wait until I heard the chase scene start, and then I'd immediately get the fuck out of that room, because he's always kind of creeped me out. Like, a lot. But, um, anyway. Yeah, let's, after that little adrenaline rush, let's, uh, let's try for room 700. I don't know what I'm doing. Um... This room's purple and stuff. This room's not. Um, God, this is a fucking long hallway. Holy shit. Alright, oh god. Oh god, it's creepy. Here. Um, this old place is somehow even worse than a new Geo Labs. Although it seems to have been constructed with a much larger budget than a new lab, nothing works quite right. I can see why it was abandoned so quickly. I wonder if they really need something for worth salvaging. I don't know. Let's turn the lights on. That looks like the correct way to go. That certainly isn't, but uh, just making sure. I don't want to miss anything. This facility is quite odd. Some of the equipment doesn't seem quite right, almost as if it were designed for people without hands. Also, I'm not sure if it's just faulty electronics, but the power keeps fluctuating and weird noises are coming from the air ducts. Air ducts. Not air ducts. Air ducts. Oh shit. Hey. How are you doing? Alright, you just you just have fun there. Um, Speaker just said that there were things we needed to salvage from this place. I'm starting to worry that a loose specimen may be included in a list of things for us to retrieve. I'll just shut off again. Is everything broken in here? No, everything is working exactly as intended. I don't know what to do. I can't think. Well, I feel strange. I'm hiding from that thing. I feel like something is going on my skin. I can't seem to tear it off fast enough, and I'm losing a lot of blood. That sounds like a bit of an issue. Oh no. You have to keep it close. It becomes something else when it gets too far away. Something I can't outrun. 
Hey. Hey. You're faster than you were. Then again, this isn't everything in this game. Also, you look much cooler. Well, okay then. Hey. This is gonna be very painful. Okay, so you're only fast when you're close by. That's not good. Why can't you be fast when you're not close by and slow when you are? That would be a lot more beneficial to me. Basically, if you try to outrun this thing, it will get even faster to the point where you can't outrun it. And at that point, you're pretty much fucked. So, uh... Yeah. Don't let it get out of your vision and keep your eye on it at all times. And, um... Oh no. Hey. This may be a problem. Uh, may have to take some damage. Nope. Okay, that door was unlocked. Awesome. Okay. I'm not going to swing my axe at you because I know that triggers your transformation. Whoa. Okay. What the fuck? That's bullshit. You should not be able to walk through specimen one. This is actually one of the few specimens that couldn't walk through while it's in the original. But yeah, you just have to be patient with us. Obviously, you want to not get too close to it, but you also don't want to get too far away. Because... Hey. Okay. Bit too fast for comfort, though. It's like specimen six, but less in okay. Hey. Hey. There's another thing for you to walk through. Hey. Come on. I know it's okay, you're not gonna do this. Isn't this a nice painting? I like that painting. I like that painting too. These are just some really, just some really nice artwork, honestly. Don't you agree? I just calmly turn these corners without transforming into anything. Okay, uh, I'd rather you don't do that either. But, you know what, it's better than the, uh, alternative. Alright, it's gone. So I can actually run now. Whoa. It never even turned into the, uh, its other form. I'm not going to spoil it for people who don't know what it is, but then again. If you don't know what it is, you should be watching, you should either be watching a full blind playthrough of this game, or playing it yourself, honestly. Unless you just want to watch me for whatever reason, in which case I'm not complaining, trust me. I appreciate that you would rather watch me play this than other people, but maybe you're just comparing my reactions and stuff, I don't know. But either way, I'm just going to stop talking before I dig myself into a hole. <laughs> Alright. 
um, still don't know, like, I'm pretty sure those cobwebs are just for decoration, but I have interacted with one before. I'm not entirely sure what this pen is. Honestly, I don't believe that I want to know about this game. Alright. Totally not a Five Nights at Freddy's reference. Um. Alright. This way is green. I don't know why I point that out every time. Okay. We're a bit too far away to actually scare me there. I'd expect swinging my axe at a cobweb to do something, but apparently not. I'll go ahead and check down here. Oh, hey, it's specimen eight. Hey. What if I don't want my flesh to sustain your children? You can go through walls. That doesn't make me happy. I, I should be running. I don't know why I'm just like calmly walking away from the thing that is currently trying to murder me. Okay. Alright. Um. Because I don't want to die. I like how sometimes the chase music just doesn't play. I am in a mistake. I don't want my flesh to sustain the children. Oh no, this is bad. Holy shit. Okay. That was like right in my left ear. Or that was directly in my left ear. I don't think right is the correct word to use there. Well, he's. I like how I'm actually getting a lengthy chase with Specimen 8 now. I'm actually happy about this, because I kind of like Specimen 8. Um, he didn't chase me for long last time, if I recall correctly. I am actually recording this the same day as the last episode, I just don't remember anything that happened in the last episode. For some reason. I'm not making that joke again. Okay, he's gone now. But I am still going to run. I'm getting this one confused with the other one that has a path forward and a path on the right. The only difference is the other one actually leads to a door. Left, 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 left. What the fuck? Okay. Well, that makes no sense, but alright. I don't- I didn't expect an endless maze. But not an endless maze. A Lost Woods type area to make sense, so. Um. Yeah. I 
must investigate this brain every time I see it, because I know at some point you actually can interact with it. I don't know if they changed that point in the remake. I know in the original, I think it's like from 900 and onwards. Just making sure I don't miss anything, which I probably will anyway, because... Oh, hey, it's this room. Okay. Oh, this is a minigame room, so it's safe anyway. This starts being available at room 800, I believe. In the original, anyway. Um... This is a very fucky room. That's not a word I use often. Actually, I think it is, but I just didn't really notice until now. Hi, you actually look really cool in this light. Cool isn't really the word most people would use to describe that. Hi, you also look cool in this lighting. Why do these, like, kawaii cardboard cutouts? That's some of the for you. No, what, like, why are they so cool looking? That. In the purple rooms. There's a skull on a carpet. I don't think that's very sanitary. I charge directly into the cobweb every time. I still think this is a cool lighting effect. As is this. I just I, I like the shading and stuff in these games. It just looks so much cooler than the original where it's like the walls and floor are purple, but nothing that's actually inside the room is. Well that was a stupid that was a stupid idea. Um, have I been chased by specimen two? Seventh room? Since like the first time I encountered him? Don't believe I have. I'm not complaining, he actually is rather annoying because he slows you down, but. Still, I mean, I want to see every specimen at least twice, and I've already seen specimen six twice. I never want to see him again. So this room is—I always forget how dark this specific room is. Right, unless something starts chasing me in the next few rooms, I should be almost done. So, um. Oh god, I just remembered which specimen is next. Okay. Uh, I, I was n not counting specimens that I've already encountered. I, I, I just remembered which new specimen is next. I was about to say, oh, specimen 8 again. Nope, it's Howard. Ah, damn it, Howard. You attacked me three times last time. That's not okay. Howard... I, I, I talked to the developers. Well, I had, like, a, a two-tweet conversation. But, um, apparently, there is a 20% chance of encountering Howard in every loop. So, Howard... No. I'm just gonna keep saying that until it actually happens. Oh, it didn't even happen that time. I I am perfectly fine with this. Anyway, if you people have enjoyed this video, leave a like. If you have anything to say about this video, leave a comment. If you have any suggestions for future videos, whether in a game or in real life, 
let me know in a comment or a private message. If you're watching this on YouTube and you want to see more content like this, subscribe. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you people next time. I wasn't expecting that one room to take so long. I would have waited a bit to say my outro, but, uh... Bye. Keep a little pep in this stuff.